Oh, do you need to be like, like a full sprint or some shit? I don't know. All right. Why, what the fuck? Why can't you use it? Huh? Yeah, what the... This is so weird. Okay, that's weird. Let's just press R2. What the fuck? Sure. Oh, here we go. We got the Drodros. Evading Fury Bomb will pressure it. All right. It's on you. Okay, yep. Uh huh. I'm sure if that was me, I got that there, but it's like the limit break thing, and like Cloud just got it like that. Alright, cool. Fuck him, dude. Alright. Big ass desert region. Hey, that. Both been assessed, that's all good then. They weak to wind. Going all out. Uh huh. Nice. Yeah, let's get these towers first. I think that's probably the way to go. Do the towers and then do the rest. I mean, if I get a quest objective along the way, fuck it, I'll do it. I'll take it. Yep. 
Magnifies maxed out, cool. I don't need that two extras or one extra. Uh huh. And Yuffie. Yeah, all right. I really need shit that has more slots. Ideally? Yeah. Alright. Wait, hold up. The thing is right there, the loot's just up there. Yep. I mean, I'll take the loot. Sweet. Let's get the loot. Give me the goods. Is there even anything else up here? There better be. Okay, there is. Good. Good. I mean, there's two fucking boxes. <laughs> eh. Alright, one extra miracle. But you know, that's not that bad, to be honest. I'll take that. That's fine. I mean, we still need to be able to get all the things from the mog shops, so. I'll take it. Um. There's my boy. Oh, what the fuck? Hold up. Is 
So I think we want to go this way. Hmm? Oh. Unless I'm meant to like pull up or something. I don't know. Hmm. Don't know. Don't know. Whatever. Well, here we go. Here's uh part one of the um. What are the thing? Whatever the thing's called. I see you're approaching the signal. The uh, Crota relics. Be somewhere in the canyon's ruins. Yeah. These ruins are closely connected with the life stream, and it's thought that they were created to help guide it through the veil. I have complete faith your efforts will greatly aid our planet. Okay. To just be in the presence of the Nanaki is such an honor. No. To just be in the presence of the Nanaki is such okay. an honor. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> My precious material, where are you? No need to be shy, come out. You be gonna take you home. <laughs> oh! Oh my god! Yuffie! Nile! Hulk! Billy Bob! It's so good to see you! Hey, that's fucking awesome. We were worried you might not have made it out in time. Ah, yes, the awkward nerdy chick. <laughs> the awkward, cute, nerdy chick from uh, Yuffie DLC. So, awesome. Where's Sona? Um, hey, Shaz, how's it going? Awesome. Sounds good. I had pork belly for dinner. It was nice. Well, where are my manners? These guys are from Avalanche HQ. They're the ones who helped me out back in Midgar. And I don't think they need an introduction. <laughs> Y'all were at the Shinra building, weren't you? Tell me. Was Wedge with you? Or did you see him? <laughs> if you can tell me anything, anything at all, Please. Wedge, he... I'm sorry. Don't be. Just... I need to know. Oh. After the Sector 7 plate fell, the things we saw and heard... I was we were gonna get like a flashback or something. It was... hell. We wanted to help. We really did. But how? It all seemed so hopeless that's when the call came from the folks at avalanche hq we learned it was the company that dropped the plate and that they were going to drop another unless we stopped them hq needed volunteers to help storm the shinra building this was our chance we knew it was the right thing to do all of us Wedge oh, here we go. Yes. Flashback time. Sweet. We'll infiltrate the building via the underground parking facility. That sounds pretty good, Chaz. I, uh, yeah. Each and every floor. I just had, I bought like a bunch of these pre-made uh, pork bellies from the groceries today. Contact with Lucia's team. I think we have to assume they're all... That's enough. First... We'll check in with Matt. On it. Let me just scooch on over here. I'm Wedge with the splinter cell. Uh, Barrett's crew, right? Mm -hmm. Here, uh, try one of these. It'll help you calm down. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, see, you're, uh, it looks like a BLT with egg or some shit. Go on, eat up. <laughs> I love old mate. It's Badger from uh, Breaking Bad. Is the voice actor for Wedge. Our team was heading upstairs to take out the president. I know what you're thinking. Avalanche doesn't do that. But when the plate fell, the rules changed. <sighs> <sighs> Come on, man. Get the lead out. Don't want to be left behind. Hey, thanks for the assist. All right. 
We're almost there, boys. Oh my god. Oh, is that the mayor? At long last, we're gonna take back our world, find the bastards who stole it, and send him to hell. Yeah. yeah. I've got friends up there who need to know we're coming. Oh, uh, uh, sorry, but I didn't want them to get hurt, sir. <laughs> Go, I'll catch up. Ray, we were all fired up, ready to fight. Oh, fuck. Oh, Jesus. We couldn't believe it. It was him. Thank you. <laughs> Damn it. Oh, you haven't done this yet, Chaz? Huh? Hey, y'all heard that, right? I thought you would have done this by now. Barrett, those who pass on become one with the live stream. I know what you thought you heard, but it was probably just the wind. <sighs> Whatever. In times past, the Cetra came to fonts like these to give thanks to the live stream. There aren't many left, so we wanted to help preserve the few still standing. It felt like the least we could do, you know? For all those who return to the planet. Hey, Barrett, why don't we give them a hand? Help them spruce things up. There anything we can do for you? I don't know, restore the planetary fonts? They're this region's main source of energy. Uh. for the live stream. But when they're as busted as this one here, you can't even get close to do repairs. Mako's way too dense. So we figured we'd use a probe, fix the fonts remotely. Okay, well, yeah, you, you will be able to. Thing is, little guy's just too old. Probably better off in a junkyard than with us. Perhaps I can be of service? Robotics is one of my areas of expertise. Meet Robot Chadley. <laughs> Robo Chad? Or Robo Chad, if you prefer something abridged. Oh my god. At any rate, you should now have complete control. Prefer something abridged? Prefer something machine abridged? Okay. Okay, restore the font. In Gears and Gambits, you must program robots with gambits and actions and send them into battle with the aim of reaching the center of the spring and vanquishing the enemy leader. Emerging Victorious will restore the planetary font. I've heard, I've heard people talk about this mini game. Or at least, or at least the name of it. I have no idea what it is though. Based on that description, it sounds like lemmings, kind of. Or something, I don't know. Three types of robots can be deployed, each operating in accordance with its gambits and actions. Oh my god, Final Fantasy XII reference? Gambits? Hello? Uh, which program to pri prior to the battle? Gambits determine a target, actions determine what the robot will do to the target. For the first battle, let's use the AI set by Chadley. Okay. All right.
Robots can be deployed from any of the three portals and will then move along their lane towards the enemy leader in the center. Press X to view each available robot's gambits and actions. The electric down, fire down icons above a foe's HP gauge indicate its elemental weaknesses. Try to deploy robots that can exploit these vulnerabilities. Type 1, effective against foes weak to ice. Type 2, effective against foes weak to fire. And type 3, effective against foes weak to lightning. So 1 is ice, 2 is fire, 3 is lightning. More mini games, of course! Um, yeah. The ATP gauge in the bottom left slowly fills, and once it has reached the acquired amount, you can deploy another robot. The ATP cost of each robot type varies according to its gambits and actions. Try deploying another unit once the ATP gauge is sufficiently full. Note you can always assess enemies with square. Pressing square allows you to view information on the enemy unit, such as their gambits and actions. The same method can also be used to view your robots from any ability uses. Okay. Damn, so we got fucking gambit system. From uh, 12, basically. Like a light version of it. Uh, weak against fire. Yep. Oh. Advanced foe actions. Like your robot, some foes have advanced actions of their own. Such enemies will be designated by a one, so make sure to assess them with square to avoid triggering their advanced protection conditions. No fuck off and get sorted out. No worries, Shaz. Yeah, I'll definitely watch your stream once I finish. For sure. King Flat. Uh, yep. Um, currently targeted by five foes. Oh, okay. So it triggers barrier with four foes present in the lane. Okay. So it's like we almost want to like trick, do multiple lanes to not trigger those abilities. As you can see, pressing L to R2 switches between portals as allows you to deploy robots into other lanes and outmaneuver, maneuver, maneuver, outmaneuver the enemy. Three portals share an HP gauge. Yep, okay. Uh, you can access the special abilities shared between your pools by pressing triangle. Uh, press left and right to select a specific skill to move the area of effect and X to activate it. Alright. Yeah, nice. Gears and game it's time limit. Remember, you must defeat the enemy leader within the world of time. Yep, okay. Oh. Alright, we want to get anti fire against this guy. Mm hmm. Nice. Ooh, anti-lightning. Yep. Yep. Anti lightning. Now 
with anti lightning. Okay, we got anti blizzard on this one. Yep. There we go. Fuck him up. Nice. Bro, what? There we go, nice. Cool. That's cool. I like that. It's like... Yeah. That's cool. I can dig it. No, we got more of the live stream theme from I believe that light will lead us to Advent Children. Ruins. <laughs> and another font to fix too, I'll bet. Is it okay if we tag along? Sure, why not? Whatever beef I've got with you HQ kids, <laughs> and its welfare takes priority. Well, they just weren't ready to hear the news that they needed to be more hardcore. Yet at least. Oh fuck. <sighs> okay. Um Alright, let's get to this stroke of our stop if we can. The planet is incredible. Planet is incredible. Wedge must have been one hell of a cook. <laughs> Wish we could have talked more. Wedge must have been one. The pace around here is a lot more laid back than the hustle and bustle of Midgar. Honestly, I could get used to this. Look at the brothers kicking their feet. Oh my god. Okay, let's uh, do this here. This is it across, okay, it's across, it's across there. A variant yeah, cool. Muhammad arisen, with armored scales red as the canyon soil, and an edge cool. born of flesh mounted on its back. Its capacity for destruction far surpasses that of the original Bahamut. Nice. Hell yeah. So yeah, Bahamut Arisen is basically near Bahamut from the original. Yep. Fucking what? Dirt, 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 dirt. Okay, yep. Damn, okay. trying to unlock it actually would be nice to have um
Hmm. Okay, I think we're meant to take that gliding platform. Oh. Go in there. Oh, we can't. Okay, cool. Oh, it's locked. Never mind. Eh? All right. Yep. So we're just gonna try and glide down there. What? Ah, you cock. Go again. Why is she just... Okay. I don't know. I don't understand this gliding stuff. It's fucking weird. What? What the... F oh my god. Okay. Whatever. Um... Okay. I really don't understand this fucking gliding stuff. It doesn't really make much fucking sense. Like sometimes you glide, sometimes you just fall straight down. Uh... Oh, hello. The little fella. There he is. Yes, little fella. There we go. Give him a little pet. There we go. Yes. Do, do. So good, bro. The music's awesome. I love it. I love it. Uh, right. Okay. We need to go this way. Oh, hang on. That's new. Yeah, that's definitely new. Lightning. Dicks. Yep. 
nice. Yeah, nice. place yes yes let's go we want that shit like now yes i literally just like pogged like <laughs> oh my god moogles yes <laughs> um all right that looks like it's like up top okay No, thank you. Ooh, what's this? A desert cave? I feel like this is going to be related to a quest later on. Call me crazy. Yeah. But wait. Hmm. All right, let's go, Chocobo. Looks like there's like a broken ramp or something. Oh, okay. Alright, yeah. Oh, the fuck was that? What? What? I don't understand why I'm just falling. What the f What? This is so janky. <laughs> What is going on? This doesn't make any fucking sense. <sighs> okay. Like, yeah, there's this. Right. But then, like, it just doesn't work because you're just fucking flying around like an asshole. Now, I think now I understand why people don't like this part. It's because it doesn't work. Like, this jump just doesn't work. 
It doesn't work as you're being pushed forward and you can't control it. Am I crazy? Like, this is a, it doesn't work. Like, unless you just do that. But even then, like... Oh, oh, no. It doesn't, that doesn't work. It genuinely doesn't work. Okay. Yeah, it do it doesn't it just it just straight up doesn't work. This is actually really fucking shit. What? Like you clearly that's what you're meant to do, right? It just doesn't work. What the fuck? Like this, this gliding shit. Yeah, it doesn't work. Wait, hold up. Are you, are you meant to press R2 to glide? What? Uh, well, okay. I guess? I guess? I don't, I don't know, man. Why not just, just do it automatically instead of like you're relying? Because you can't press it whilst you're ascending. <sighs> okay. Maybe a bit more thought could have been put into how this works. There we go. See? Okay, so you just have to press R2 when you jump, so you glide. That's fucked. That's so fucking stupid. I'm sorry, that's really fucking stupid. Oh, okay. Nope. Like, it's, I feel like it should just glide automatically. Like, obviously that's what you're wanting to do. here. It's like, it's like a cage. The fuck? Okay. Oh, I'm meant to climb up here and then jump over or something? one. Is that what I'm meant to do? Like, just jump off and glide over? No? Okay, never mind. I thought, yeah, we were gonna, like, jump off and glide over with the trick bow. Okay. Alright, 
Got some griffins and shit. Leave me alone. Hey, it's a little fella. Let's go, little fella. Yep. Come on. There we go. Cool. Give him a pet. Yeah, there we go. Nice. this jump maybe I think it was this one Is this way? Uh huh. Ourselves an owl. Yep. Yep. Cross this way. Hill. All right. Here we go. Now the gliding makes more sense. I'm less frustrated at it now. You gotta hold the jump as you go through. You can't just like let go of the sprint. That makes sense. It's just a little bit. I was like, it couldn't really explain it. I don't feel, I don't feel like I explained it very well. So I was getting a bit annoyed. Is that dilapidated ship? Oh, it's not very far from here at all. Yeah, cool. Probably ran right past it. Mm hmm. Oh, here we go. Hello. Little fella. Yep. Yep. There he is. Nice. Excellent. 
All right, yeah, I think this is the way to Mog now. Yeah, there it is. Sick. Well, I wasn't expecting to be right at the top, though. Wanna hang out with the Moogles? That's why we're here. All right, Moogle time. Mm-hmm. Let's get it. Okay. Would you mind rounding up all the Mooglets for me? Mischief level six. Okay. Oh my god, what the fuck? How didn't I see that? Restart. Awkward. No. Excellence. Oh. What? That was not what I wanted, but okay. I thought it was going to take me the other way. Oh, shit. No, fuck you. Stop it. Okay. Mm-hmm. Yep. Here you go. Pause away. Boom. Nailed it. Thanks so much. There we go. <laughs> That's just hectic. We got one left to do? Yeah. In Evil Hype. This Emporium is officially open, and it's all thanks to you. There's only one more left to go. Thought so. Come so far, Koopo. I hope that you'll see it through. Over here. Hell yeah. Of course we will. How could we not? Welcome, Koopo. Yep. Ooh. Very nice. Very nice. Cool. Sweet. Empowerment earrings. Thanks so much. And we got more booklets as well. Hell yeah. Hmm. Hard questions. How do we get over there? It looks like it's, um, yeah, over that way. No, that way. 
Yeah. I think there's uh, the rocks, those rocks that you can climb up, maybe? I'm not 100% sure. Oh, we're gonna jump here? No, I don't think so. All right. Yeah, let's go. Mm-hmm. That's how you get to that tower. Hey, nice. Cool. Sick. That's cool as fuck. Hell yeah. chest up here well box not chest and the activator sweet awesome Capital Tower. All right. Yep. All uh, right. Yep. We completely skipped the monsters that are usually at the bottom of the tower as well. <laughs> Interesting. Um. Got Bahamut. Interesting. Yeah, okay. Yep. Is that right? Nice. Cool. 